Hi everybody! Welcome to this session where I'm going to share my insights relating to vocal jazz technique with all of you. My name is Katharine van Opstal and I'm a jazz singer and also a researcher at Royal Conservatoire of Antwerp in Belgium. Is that? I've been researching how we use our voice in vocal jazz technique the recent three years. Why did I do that? Well, for once, uh, because I needed it. Too much I had the feeling that my voice uh, a good sound was a matter of coincidence and uh, I wanted to change that. Now there's not much literature to find about vocal jazz technique so I decided to do research myself and I asked myself the question how am I doing this? And helped by spectrographic research and a still voice model I developed some exercises specific for vocal jazz technique. So today I'm going to share with you the different setups of the voice of which I have found that they uh, are most likely to be used in jazz vocal music. So I hope you enjoy this exploration together with me. I'm not alone. Next to me is the great guitar player and also the advisor in my research, Hendrik Wraakman. Yay! <laughs> so he will be accompanying me. So um, sit back, relax, get ready to join us and um, let's explore this mixing tail model. First of all, we're going to take a look at speech. A lot of time, speech, uh, speech sound is used in jazz, especially in bossa nova, but it's also the basis in swing. So what is speech? It's uh, when you talk, when you just talk to like your neighbor. So if you just say, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, you're probably in speech. Then what, what, is, what is working in my voice? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, not a lot actually. Actually only my true vocal folds are vibrating and they're closed really thick. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, but everything else is relaxed. I'm not Monday, you, I'm just Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So let's try that on a song. I've chosen the song Summertime and we're gonna, we're gonna just say a few lines of the, of the song. So we say, summertime and living is easy. Now pay attention to how that feels in your body. Fish are jumping and the weather is high. Your dad is rich and your mama's good looking. So hush little baby, don't you cry. Now I'm gonna sing and just keep the same sensation. So I'm not gonna do a lot. I'm just gonna use this, this good vibrating sound. Summertime and the living is easy. Fish are jumping and the weather is high. Oh, your daddy's rich and your ma, she's good looking. So hush, little baby. Yeah, so try this and notice how it feels, notice how it sounds, notice what you want to keep and notice what you want to change. Another part of the mixing table model is the facetto. And facetto is actually quite the same as speech in the fact that everything is relaxed, but I'm only, I'm not closing th my vocal folds thick anymore, but they're more closed stiff. Ah, if you blow a horn, hoo hoo! You can find your facetto, or if you sigh, ah. So if you if you really pay attention to the feeling, you don't have this uh, closed vibration anymore. And you know, in speech, my breath was more like standing still, and now it will more um, flowing be flowing out. So let's try how this sounds in summertime. Summertime. are jumping and the weather is high oh your daddy's rich and your ma she's good looking so hush little baby don't you cry <laughs> yeah. 
Good. I'm not used to do that a lot, so <laughs> I really had to pay focus. But it's nice to be able to do it because sometimes you want that sound. The third sound, the third sound I chose on my mixing table model that happens a lot in jazz, is the cry sound. And what do you, when do you get that sound? When you cry. So we're going to cry, like, oh, I didn't get what I want, and I'm, I'm really sad. I'm not, like, sobbing. It's not, oh, I'm so sad. It's just um, a, a little young, young whining. Oh, oh, my God, I'm so... Uh, no, it's not fair, it's not fair. And if I now pay attention to my feeling, I feel my vocal folds, my true vocal folds. They're not thick, they're not stiff, but they're closed really, really, really thin. And also my throat is much more open than, uh, than when I did speech. So what, what I'm doing is I'm retracting my false vocal folds. Also here, I feel a tilt in my thyroid cartilage. Try, try to say... Monday, Tuesday, and then cry. Then maybe you can feel it. What else am I doing? Oh, my tongue is high. And I'm also raising my soft palate. Yeah, just, just try it and see what you can feel. Summertime. Oh my God, I'm so sad. It's summertime. I love winter. <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> summertime. So maybe you know you know singers who sing a lot in speech. Maybe you know singers who, who sing a lot in falsetto, or maybe they sing a lot in cry. Now you can recognize it, and you can um, feel it in your own body, how, how it feels for you, and then you can easily go to that, to that, uh, to that sound. Um, so these are like the three basic, basic recipes where in jazz, a lot of times the sound is built upon. And then you have, uh, you see on the mixing table, there are some extra notes where you can play with to um, like equalize your sound. And they're like, yeah, you, you can make it higher or brighter or lower. Let's explore the, uh, these ones too. If we, the first one is the larynx. The larynx is the combination of the thyroid and the cricoid. You can move it, yeah, you can just relax it if you're quiet breathing. Summertime and the living is easy. Or you can drop it, like when you're yawning. Summertime and the living is easy. You can also really raise it. Like when you're going to scream. Summertime and the living is easy. You notice how my, the color of my voice changes from, um, from high to, when it goes from high to lower. So let's do a summertime and I'll, I'll just play with it a bit so you can hear the different sounds. First I start mid. Summertime And the living is easy Now we go to lower Fish are jumping And the weather is high Hi. Oh, your daddy's rich And your ma, she's good looking little baby don't you cry <laughs> imagine I would sing like that right <laughs> but um, yeah look for singers who use this a lot I think Sarah Vaughan uses a lot of low larynx but also a lot of high and a lot of mid so she's like the the the, the larynx moving queen or something you can post in the comments if you know songs or, or singers who sing a lot with high larynx or low larynx or or whatever the the second knot is the aes knot now aes is short for the airy epiglottic sphincter and it's a muscle who runs from your arytenoids to your epiglottis now if you narrow it you get this a lot of people also call it twang so it creates like a resonance between two and four kilohertz. 
that gives you a um, yeah, brighter, nastier, more metally sound. And um, yeah, you can play with it. You can do a lot. Summertime! Or you can do a little. Summertime! Or not. Summertime! You can play with it. So, <laughs> let's do a nasty one. <laughs> Summertime And the living is easy Without fish or jumping And the weather is high Oh, your daddy's rich And your mom, oh, she's good looking So hush, little baby So great if you want to sing blues or if you want to sing Amy Winehouse. Um, there are a lot of singers who use it in different variations. Really nice to play with. Then you have the torso, which is in fact how you how you how active your your back is and your uh, alignment. So let's try. I'm relaxing now. <laughs> Without. Summertime And the living is easy Fish are jumping And the weather is high Oh, your daddy's rich And your ma is good looking So hush, little baby Nice. Do you notice a different kind of sounds it gives? And it's so nice to know that when I choose a sound, I choose the same thing with my body because I, I practice that and then it makes everything goes more effortless and more smoothly. And I don't have to rely on coincidence anymore um, when I choose my sounds. So the last one is the amount of extra air you're going to put into it. Um, let's say... Especially in Bossa Nova, there's sometimes you have a more breathy voice, which doesn't mean that you are necessarily in falsetto. You can have a breathy voice on speech too. That's what I'm going to try. So we're going to do a very um, summertime on the beach uh, with cocktails. Imagine that. <laughs> summertime And the living is easy Jumping and the weather is high, so fine. Oh, your daddy's rich, and your ma, she's good looking. So, hush, little baby. go to the beach <laughs> okay folks this was it i hope now you get a, a notion of all the different parts of your voice where you can play with i know this is just a teaser but uh, already now you maybe you felt some things or you um, you have like ah yeah but this singer there and oh i'm actually singing in falsetto but i want to do speech so now now i can change it uh things like that please let me know in the comments or you can also mail me uh, also check out our next videos and check out uh, the version of summertime i'm going to play uh, in a different video where i'm going to try to use all the different things i now talked about in just one song it's like a vocal puppetry um yeah so thank you to hendrik for accompanying me and uh, thank you olivier for the recording yeah he waves you cannot see that but he waves really kind um, I think that's it. Okay, see you next time and thank you for watching. Bye!